Hello, I am Dr. Nagaraj Puttaswamy. I am a laparoscopic and a bariatric surgeon at Punya Hospitals, Bangalore. Strata therapy. A lot of uh, new uh, inventions uh, in the treatment of uh, GERD, that is gastroesophageal reflux disease or iatus hernia are coming up. Because the frequency of uh, this condition has become more. Just because uh, the lifestyle modifications what we have gone into and uh, sleeplessness and smoking, alcohol, all these are getting into a condition called uh, um, reflux esophageal disease or small scale uh, hiatus hernias. Strata therapy is a modification or uh, maybe a, you know less invasive surgical procedure which can be done on outpatient procedure. See what in strata therapy is done is endoscopically we put in a electromagnetic substance or a material or equipment which will cause some amount of tissue damage in the lower esophageal sphincter region. Why would we damage the tissue there? See, the tissue damage is done so that there will be some amount of swelling in the esophageal sphincter region and once the swelling develops or the edema develops, it will cicatrize or scarring will happen in that region and finally it will help in improving the competence of the stricture. See, we speak about the stricture or the sphincter not being competent enough to hold back the food in the stomach. In, during this process of strata treatment, we increase the competence by in, inducing scarring in the lower esophageal sphincter region. Once that is done, the possibility of uh, improvement of the symptoms what the patient was experiencing, that is regurgitation or belching of food or food coming back into the esophagus becomes significantly less. But it is a relatively newer type of management and it has its own advantages and disadvantages. Long term uh, uh, what is it, assessment and analysis has not been very you know, clear. So because only a 2-3 years old uh, procedure it is. So we have to be waiting for you know, updated information maybe 5 years or 10 years down the line. We should be in a position to tell whether it will be a long term useful condition or procedure or not. But uh, alternatively you know, medical management and uh, lifestyle modification will definitely help. Uh, but if the patient is not getting helped uh, and there is a relatively bigger hernia or uh, if uh, the lower esophageal sphincter is very very lax, uh, the ideal would be laparoscopic fundoplication.